at some point were running for governor of the state of Illinois. Running for governor, uh, serving as governor, is about taking responsibility. Uh, it's about identifying problems and addressing those, uh, uh, those problems when they occur. So, so Mr. Rauner, uh, who is running based on his business credentials, uh, and argues and makes the case that he's going to run Illinois like he has run his businesses, is running businesses that are being convicted, that have been accused of, have been convicted of fraud, uh, that have been accused of mismanagement, uh, that have been the subject of numerous lawsuits, that have been uh, uh, a part of major uh, uh, SEC investigations and settlements, $150 million, is not a settlement that you enter into when you've been doing things right. Uh, so what does this tell us about uh, Mr. Ron the businessman? Well, it tells us a couple of things. Number one, it tells us that, uh, that uh, he is not a businessman that creates jobs. He is not a businessman that produces, that creates a product. He's not a businessman that improves services. He is a businessman that creates profits. He is in the business of the pursuit of profits. So it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter whether you lay off employees, whether you cut services. Many lawsuits are, in effect, a product of allegations of cuts in services. Uh, at the end of the day, uh, it's a business that's driven uh, by profit. Government is not a business that's driven by profit. There may be casualties in Mr. Rauner's business. That you can't have casualties in, in, uh, in government. Government is there to prevent casualties. Government is there to deal with the casualties, so to speak. But, at the, but what does this also tell us about Mr. Rauner, the businessman? Uh, Mr. Rauner is a businessman that simply doesn't take responsibilities. He takes the money, but he doesn't take the responsibilities.